a while but I am back with another fab under 50 video so this one is not a wig um, it definitely does mimic a wig that is very popular here on YouTube but it is not a wig this is well technically it's a wig it's a U part wig and it I have the unit sewed down I did make the unit myself with uh, glue and a line nylon cap and then um, you know cut it made it a U part and sewed that sucker down. This hair is not human hair. This hair is a synthetic blend and it goes by the name of Malaysian Iron Texture Natural Straight by Shake and Go. Here's the packaging and I got it in a color too. So it came on this, everything came attached like this weft is. And um, it came in three, um, it came in three different lengths. So it came in a 14, a 16, and an 18. Each length had two bundles attached. So there was one bundle of four, 16 here and then another bundle and then 14 and 18 on this side. It also came with a closure. I did not use the closure. Um, it was, I don't really do the full weave thing unless it's a lace closure, which it was not. But um, yeah, this pack, that whole pack with eight bundles and a closure was only $19.99. Just let that sink in for a second. $19.99 for eight bundles of thick, kinky, straight, synthetic, synthetic blend. I've gotten so many compliments on this hair and it's so easy to, to comb through. I've had a few tangles, nothing that I couldn't um, just comb out with a paddle brush. I do get some shedding here and there. Most of it at first was because I had to do a lot of cutting of the wefts to get it, um, you know, fill in the spaces in the U-part wig, but nothing out of the norm, nothing that you wouldn't expect from synthetic blend hair. So just so you guys can see where it stops, it comes below my breast area, all the way down to like my rib cage. So that's the 18 inch I did two whole the two uh, bundles of the 18 inch i did one bundle of the 16 inch and then i did like i think like one and a half or one whole bundle i don't remember of the 14 inch because i have it all spread out i still haven't um you know got it all back together and packaged it back up yet because i got that lazy spirit deep down in me but um, I didn't have to use that much hair. Now this, there are other videos floating around of hair similar to this, but it's a bit poofier. It's like kinky straight hair that hasn't been flat ironed. And this one mimics kinky straight hair that has been flat ironed. So if you flat iron your hair like I did, um, it blends in really, really well with this hair. Let me give you guys a close up so you can see the texture up close. So yeah, that's the way the hair looks up close. The texture, like I said, really does represent um, our kinky 4C straight flat iron hair very well, especially for only $20. The only cons that I have about this hair, aside from some light shedding and some light tangling, because I do have to carry a brush with me. Like I can't just go out the house and be like, oh, I'll be fine without a brush. At the nape of the neck, um, it's still pretty hot out here, so if I'm sweating at the nape of the neck, it will get a little, little crunchy up in there. But I do need to, I just brush it out and it's, it's not a big deal. I don't have to like cut it because it's that bad. No, I can just brush it out and I'll be fine. You can, finger detangling this hair is not the easiest. You have to be very strategic about that. But those are uh, the only complaints that I have as far as tangling and shedding. Um, flat, ironing it, flat ironing the hair, it will make it a little bit of a silky texture, but only for a second. Once it kind of dries out, or um, not dries out, dries out for real. Um, once it kind of cools down, it goes back to this texture it doesn't it's not like it gets melted or you know severely straightened to the point where it loses its texture now curling the hair 
that's another story. You can't, you can't curl this hair. I tried to curl my bang to make it, you know, give it the little flip back thing. And I picked up some of the weave hair along with my hair to make it blend so that I can curl it all at the same time. My hair curled, this hair bent like paper. Like, there was no, there's no curling this hair. That's not really a big deal for me. I wasn't planning on curling this hair when I initially got it. And if you want to curl it just like any other synthetic blend hair, you can either flexi rod it, perm rod it, braid it and dip it in hot water. We all know how to manipulate synthetic hair. So that's not really a big deal for me, especially for the price of $19.99. So with that being said, um, I hope you guys like this hair. Again, it is the Shake and Go Malaysian Iron Texture Natural Straight Hair. There's the model. And this is a color too. So I don't know if you guys can see my lighting isn't the best in here, but it's a very, it's dark. Like it looks like it could be a 1B to me. And that's why I got it because the one and the one B were extremely dark. It looked like jet black dye. So, and I didn't want anything that was that dark and wouldn't match up with my hair properly. So that's why I went for the two and I normally get a one B. And then here are the models on the back. Now I purchased, I purchased my hair from the Sauce and Swap Me. I'm out here in Los Angeles. So if you're from Los Angeles or anywhere else, everybody knows about the Sauce and Swap Me. Um, they had different lengths and then they had the other brands with the poofy or kinky straight texture for the same price. I chose the shortest length that was available which was 18, 14, 18 16, 14. But they had, I want to say they had a 24, 22, 20. Uh, it was in the 20s, I don't remember, but I definitely did not want hair that long. Um, I've never gone that long with my hair, so, and I'm not comfortable with that much hair. But yeah, you definitely have a lot of options as far as color, as far, and as far as length and texture. I'll try to find the hair um, online so I can link it in the description box below. I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and follow me on my social media. I now have Snapchat. I'm not really sure how to use it yet. I'm still working out the kinks. Um, I've posted a couple stories, but yeah, I don't really have that many friends yet. So once I figure that out, I guess I'll start posting stories more often. Um, I'll link everything down below, and I hope you ladies have a great day. Fall is finally here for some of y'all. For us, we still dealing with this harsh desert heat. By the time you guys see this, it's probably going to be a little chillier out here in Los Angeles. But yeah, Los Angeles weather needs to get with the program. It's fall. It's no longer summer. I'll see you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.